So here we are in Mount Willard in Crawford Notch, New Hampshire. On an absolutely stellar autumn day. I mean, it could not be more beautiful today. No other climbers. Beautiful autumn foliage. Just an absolutely gorgeous day in the White Mountains. So Mount Willard was one of the early climbs that was uh, pioneered in the White Mountains back in 1929 by Robert Underhill and Lincoln O'Brien, Boston area climbers. rock before, but perhaps they hadn't done uh, as straight of a line, the most aesthetic line that we did. I did drill bolts on the lead, you know, the hand drill in those days, quarter inch, uh, raw drive bolts, uh, aluminum bolts with an aluminum hanger, and some of, I, I just climbed over and one of my bolts is still there. I mean, this is about 35 years ago. <laughs> half a lifetime ago that I did the first ascent of this route. My bolt was still over there, kind of rusty. Sort of like me, <laughs> getting a bit rusty. So, anyway, it's so fun to be out here. It's just, uh, it is, you do feel like a time traveler when you're back on the cliff. You feel that the cliff hasn't really changed that much. The rock is the same. The scenery is more or less the same. But yeah, you've changed a little bit. You know, the decades have gone by. So I'm 61 now. And uh, so I was about 25 years old when Sue and I did the first ascent of Time Traveler. It's fun to look back on it, think back on it. 